In the previous video, I mentioned the e-copy process, but for those of you that don't know what an e-copy is, this is an e-copy. These are flash drives, and this is actually three different submissions. We had a traditional 510K that had 20 volumes, volume one through 20. That was on a USB flash drive. That was one e-copy. There's a second e-copy, but this one's for a special 510K, and it was all one document. Why? Because the company, instead of splitting it up into volumes of documents, they took all the documents and PDF them together and numbered them one through probably a thousand pages, and that's the special 510K. So that's a separate e-copy. This third one here is a de novo submission. So sometimes the submissions are so large that it takes a very long time for the FDA to upload the information to their servers from your USB flash drive. And in this particular case, I couldn't even fit all the information on our normal size flash drive and I could only fit it on the larger flash drive. So one of them um, had the volumes one through 21 and the other one had the statistics and miscellaneous information. So these are the same submission, but we split the statistics and miscellaneous into one document. And this is volume one through 21 because that's how the FDA wanted us to organize it. So this is actually three different submissions and we actually prepared all three of these in the same day and sent them out to give you an idea how much work we do. Um, and uh, for those of you that aren't familiar with some of the changes that happen, happened in the e-copy process back in February of last year, they change it so all you have to do is print out the cover letter and provide this flash drive, and that's the e-copy. Whereas in before, when we started the e-copy business called FDA e-copy, we actually had to print out a hard copy of every single page of the submission and provide a flash drive. So sometimes we'd have submissions that were over a thousand pages, sometimes as big as 3,000 pages. And last, uh, maybe it was two weeks ago now, we had a 6,699 page submission and the company actually wanted a hard copy for their own purposes. Um, so we actually only provided a cover letter to the FDA and a USB flash drive, but for the company we shipped them um, two gigantic or one gigantic 14 by 14, no, I take that back, two gigantic 14 by 14 by 14 boxes with 6,000 pages in it plus um, uh, for their actual hard copy of the submission. And it was in, I think, 13 different binders. If you're interested more about e-copy process and what it entails, here we have it. And if you have to do your own, there's some free information on our website on how to do FDA e-copies.